Three, two, one. Rick here. Welcome to the channel. Um, today we're going to be actually going over a product, a paid product that came out a couple of days ago. It's called Conversio Bot. And guess what? It's a bot, but it's not a bot for Facebook. It is a bot for your website or your blog if you have a website or a blog. And I would assume that most people uh, probably do, but not everybody. But if you do, let's go check it out. <laughs> And if it's your first time here, please consider subscribing to the YouTube channel because I do put out regular videos with tips on paid marketing, free marketing, free tools, uh, product reviews like we're getting ready to do now, um, things that can help entrepreneurs like yourself to build, to grow, uh, automate, and scale a successful online business. So if these are some of the things that you're into, then why not hit that subscribe button below and smash that notification bell. That way you'll be notified every time I go live or release a new video. And why not? You know, I mean, it's free. So let's get into this content and check out this, uh, this software. Okay, so here we are on the uh, outside of the software. We're going to go ahead and log in and get into the back office and show you around the dashboard. If I can spell my name right. Okay, uh, what I've got here, if you guys can see this window that comes up, I've never explained this before in any of my videos, so I'm going to go ahead and tell you what that is. Uh, that is a, um, a password bot, I guess you could say. It, it remembers your password. So basically, every time I go to a website, and I don't know what you guys got, if you use a free tool for that, or if you have a paid tool that, that you you know put your passwords and your website addresses and all that stuff in but this is called RoboForm this is a paid tool and it's about 20 bucks a year so it's fairly inexpensive but I can tell you what guys I use this thing every freaking day I mean every day this is one of the most inexpensive uh, but yet highly used tools that I have in my arsenal and what basically what it does is once you go to the website for the first time now I've been here before because I've already logged in and, and made a bot but um, I did not save my username and password to RoboForm the first time I logged in so basically when you go to the site like you just seen me do and you put your um, username or your email in and then your password what's gonna pop up is this box right here uh, now it's gonna it's gonna automatically populate in the name whatever the website is and then it's it's also gonna populate the um, uh, the link where you went to go log in uh, and then basically it's gonna capture your username and your uh, password and then it's up to you to create different folders or categories away from the home part of that um, of that software so there's a home for RoboForm and then everything is listed in that home from A to Z but if you can create like subfolders like like I've got here online training course um, free tools paid tools uh, marketing platforms these are different file folders that I've made so Basically, what I'm trying to say is when you go to that site uh, and log in for the first time, this is what you're going to see. So it's already populated Conversio Bot in the name of the website, and it's prompted me to uh, put this uh, username and password into a folder. So uh, what is Conversio Bot? Well, I'm going to consider this 
a um, online course for training. Uh, it could be considered an online course, but I would consider this more of tools for marketing. Now, I've created that folder uh, specifically for tools that I market with, so I'm going to put it in that folder, and then I'm going to click Save. Uh, and I'm just going to... I really, really should make this a completely different video, but I want to show you this real quick. I'm going to close that out. I'm going to log back out, because I'm going to show you what I just did. Houston, we have a problem. Let's log out. Um, now I'm going to close that window out. And then I'm going to open up another tab. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down here. This bar right here is what houses all of your username and passwords. So it'll also fill different forms and things for you, you know, like surveys that you, you know, you have information that you have to constantly type in, usernames and passwords that you have to constantly type in. I remember that's what this is right here is the logins and then this is this fills forms right here um, but uh, let's see this is where I put it these are all my folders right here and everything else right here is that's in alphabetical order is what's considered my home they, in other words they don't really have a specific folder that I put them in so they're just general places that I go uh, whereas here these folders are specific places that I go. Domain and hosting, autoresponders, Gmail accounts, marketing systems that I'm a part of, uh, my monthly bills, we all hate that. I don't really like that folder and I don't go in there too often, once a month. Um, uh, social networks, tools for marketing, that's where I just put this bot. So I'm gonna go ahead and click that. And you know, I've got a lot of tools. So it opens up another completely new window and the bot is right here. It's it's in al alphabetical order too. Uh, this is really should be for another video, but watch what happens when I click this. It's going to go to the site. Boom! It's going to just automatically populate everything and then log me in. I don't ever have to remember the username and password. Once I purchase the tool, once I purchase the course, whatever it is, I log in the first time, it prompts me, I go ahead and fill out the information one time and it's done, okay? So anyways, that's that and um, that's what that is. If you guys have maybe seen that in some of my other videos, I just wanted to kind of go over it very briefly. But I will save that for another video because that is a completely different topic for another video. So now that we're inside of the back uh, back office on the dashboard of Conversio, Con Conversio, Conversio, bot. Uh, let's go ahead and go through this. Now there's a bunch of different upgrades here. They've got four different ones that you can go through. There's the done for you. There's the auto chatbot builder, Conversio Extreme. Um, you know, everything just has its um, own bells and whistles to it. So, but you really, you know, I mean, I don't know w whether you really need all of that or not. Um, you know, I'm, I'm just gonna stick with the basic, which is the pro right now, um, because I can use that commercially or uh, just use it for myself, but I can build bots and actually sell these bots to other people if I want to. So the front end is uh, the commercial license. Um, so that's uh, definitely, obviously, you got to have that. <clears throat> and it's fairly inexpensive, too. Um, now, they are going to a monthly. I'm not sure really when they're going to do that because I'm not sure when the launch uh, extends out to. I don't know if it's a two-week launch or exactly what it is, but I don't think it's very long. So depending on when you guys wind up watching this video, it could already be a monthly charge for this software, but it is pretty cool. I'll admit that. I really do like it. And uh, again, this is just really for a website or a blog. But... Uh, that's that's what this is about so whenever you want to decide to upgrade then you can go ahead and just click this upgrade here and upgrade um, other than that what you're seeing up at the top here is just basically what you're seeing right here same thing um, unless you get into the support tab here 
Uh, they want you to watch this video when you first get in here. It's just a real short introduction video as to you know what what this is and how to navigate the the back office. So that's pretty cool. Um, and then you go over here. Here's my bots. I built this bot yesterday. Um, it, it, you know, it took me a couple hours. Luckily, I had a, a template, which are they're located right here. I had a template to start with, and then I just modified that template for, you know, whatever I, I wanted to, you know, present to the people on my blog when they went there. Um, so I'm just kind of testing it out. I'm sure I'm still going to change it some more, uh, but that's the only bot that I have built right now, and that basically uh, is selling this. Uh, the software this bot on my blog um, but again I made some modifications to it to make it my own um, and just kind of testing it out I hooked up my autoresponder to it so you can integrate this to your autoresponder um, so that's pretty cool so when when somebody um, goes to the bot it doesn't automatically put them on your list you have to actually um, set the bot up to where you're asking for the email address and uh, but you know you're asking for the email address because you're going to be giving them something most likely for that like most people do on a capture page so this this bot is more or less just kind of a it's a it's a capture page you're giving them a gift and they're giving you a gift back by giving you their email um, and then you can prompt them to share or or not so you know so they can share this on social media uh, I think there's I don't know how many sites that they can share five or six but <clears throat> the cool thing about this is is I don't know that much about bots uh, you know I've messed around in um, on Facebook with uh, mini chat or Manny chat a little bit and uh, so I'm, I'm not a big bot builder or anything but what I liked about this and what kind of drew me to this one was is the templates which are right here let me get a drink real quick now if we look right here uh, there's a bunch of different ones um, and I think there's some training and stuff right here as well um, but right here are all the different bots that you can build and the ones that I like the best um, ones like this right here Get social shares one so you're giving a free gift away and um, you're prompting them within the bot to you know in exchange give them have them give you their email address um, so that's pretty cool um, what's the other one that I like they get subscriber I like this one as well kind of the same thing the difference is on this one here um, yeah I'm not sure what the difference is between these two here you're trying to get a subscriber and I think this one here is more about sharing it more than anything oh okay it is yeah so without opt-in right here so this might have been the one that I liked but I think this this has more um, more prompts um, to actually uh, ask them to share the information for this free gift whereas this one down here I believe uh, only asks them to share it towards the end after they've gotten their gift after you know they've given you their email address then at the very end it prompts them to um, to share on social media um, well, this is a bad day for me to do a video because my voice, my throat kind of hurts. Uh, so I'm not really enjoying this talking right now. <laughs> Sorry. Um, but what I like about uh, all these is, uh, you know, there's just, there's a good variety here. Uh, for a front-end product, There's it looks like a pretty decent variety of templates. The Make Money and the Webinar Registration I looked at those two. I like those. Uh, those two are my favorites, along with this one right here and uh, this one right here. Those four I like. Uh, the other ones are just kind of 
they're more niche related discount coupon codes now if you got a Shopify store some sort of e-com store I mean that's gonna be great uh, discount coupon this one opens up on exit for a discount coupon so if it looks like they're getting ready to leave uh, this one is basically this is the one that I set up uh, I have this one set up on my blog and it's basically selling this tool it's selling this product Conversio bot and uh, I went ahead and put that up on my uh, my blog and I'm gonna show you what that looks like that's the one I was referring to back here underneath my bots uh, and, you know I've got a bigger monitor up here so I'll be looking up here from time to time too um, so let's take a look and see what we've got uh, settings I'll kind of show you how it's set up when we go through here I don't want to go through it too much in too much detail because I don't want to make this a 30 minute video but you go through the builder and you build it you design it you have your settings and then you publish it launch it more or less um, so you go through here there isn't a whole lot I don't think here because a lot of these are extreme features here's your this is a basic feature um, but right here email notification settings those are on and here's where I believe this is where you um, actually enter yeah this is where you enter your autoresponder and integrate that with your autoresponder uh, right now I am using MailChimp so that's the only one that I have in here um, so you just basically you get your API key from uh, I don't know if uh, A Weber and Get Response have API keys. I think they do, but I'm not positive. But that's what I had to do with Mailchimp is just basically go get my API key and then put it into the software. And then uh, once the API key is set in there for um, you know whatever autoresponder you have, you go to the drop down menu. You go to this page. You go to the drop down menu and you find your autoresponder. And then you go over here and you find your list. That's uh, that, that you want to basically when people give a, give their email address, um, you know you want to put that to a certain list. I only have a few lists back here, so but that's a drop down menu you guys are all familiar with, and you just pick your list and and then you just come down here basically and hit save. So uh, yeah, that's that part. And I'm on builder. Or design. I must be on design. Okay, we want to go back to builder. This is where you're really going to start, and we will skip over design because we already looked at it. But some of you guys who are familiar with building bots already, you know, you know how to do this. But for others who don't, um, every precious minute of their two. You know, I could go into a more detail here, but I'm not going to. This is this is where it starts in the back office. You know, I can click that. Um, you know, and I can change the time interval between each chat. So it's sitting there. You know, typing. You know, the chat bot sitting there typing for two seconds and then boom it goes right to that that next message uh, right Houston, here uh, so you can basically have Houston, that bot have problem. type a little bit longer in case it's a longer message um, or it can be on screen a little bit longer so that the person who's on the other side can read what it is before the next message basically comes up so you can change the, the interval the time between each bubble uh, conversation on the bot and then you can put in you know videos and um, you can copy it you can move these around however you want to um, you know that's basically kind of how that works you can X one out delete it uh, user response you can put in a user response depending on you know what you are saying here um, maybe you don't need a user response for that particular one or whatever so anyways, uh, yeah, this is what we got going on. So it goes from the intro to the name, <laughs> then a quick question, and then, you know, depending on how, sorry about that, depending on how they actually answer, it's a yes or a no question when it comes down to that third, this third one right here. Um, and then it splits off no and goes to the right splits off if they say yes it goes to the left <clears throat> so 
then it just goes to all these other questions that are questions after question after explanation after explanation after question and so on and so on until you get to the bottom down here and then it just kind of all comes together so it all flows back to the very bottom part uh, of the bot and uh, when you get to the order it basically uh, does the same exact thing uh, whether you're coming through the no side or the yes side of that first question um, probably the easiest way to explain it is just to go ahead and show you so what I'm gonna do now <clears throat> Keep in mind, let me get some water here. Keep in mind, I just started this blog. Blog. I just started started it like, man, not only does my voice hurt, but I can't even talk right. I started this blog about a week and a half, maybe two weeks ago. So I really don't have any content on it. I'm just trying to kind of get the colors and, and the layout and everything. Um, I went ahead and upgraded the uh, the WordPress theme to the blog, and I'm trying to figure out how to incorporate that with you know the the basic theme that's there. Trying to figure out all the bells and whistles. So this blog doesn't have a whole lot on it, but let's let's go over and take a look at it, and I'll show you the bot in action. So here we go. I'm gonna look at this monitor. It's easier for me to see because it's a lot bigger. Okay, it's ricklafada.com. <clears throat> so as you can see at the top here, I am going to have a, a nice header up here. Not sure if I'm going to stay with these colors or not, but um, you know, here's the different pages that I've got here. Again, no content on this page right now, uh, other than the home page. Uh, the other pages don't have anything your standard social media places where people you know can go and, and follow me now I've got um, some stuff down the side here as well um, and then there's the chat bot yeah, that, uh, that people can purchase if they, the they want but it's pretty cool too because when they go to the site and I'll show you in a minute when they actually go to the site of course there's a chat bot there that tries to um, you know explain to, to you what's going on and it's going to be changing over to a monthly fee soon and um, she's basically going to prompt you to purchase the bot so that's what's kind of cool about this though because the bot is really working in your favor um, however you have it set up and then if you go to become an affiliate of the bot once you go to the site the bots there trying to prompt people to purchase it as well so um, it's it's a pretty neat deal I think but the bot is located I put this on the left hand side right here uh, mainly because I have this bot over here that is connected to my Facebook fan page um, and, I, and I really do like that one so I got them on separate sides of my of my website of my blog here um, so that's what that is this automatically opens up uh, and prompts people to start a conversation <clears throat> but the bot we're looking at right here is on this side and it just has a little red dot here and a little cartoon guy <clears throat> and what you can do with this is um, uh, you can put your own picture in here if you want you can put a fake picture of a real person um, that's not you <laughs> uh, that may be more professionally dressed or whatever and not you know in a hoodie and got a cap on but you know that's my style that's what I like and um, I'm good with that or you can use a little cartoon character here you know I went ahead and picked this guy so here's the bot so let's go ahead and take a look at it so as soon as you click it it starts talking to you and this is how I've, you can set it up different you don't have to have your picture but I thought well you know people probably need to know you know who I am and um, you know what I look like too being that I don't have a banner at the very top of my blog right now so uh, I went ahead and put a picture here but you can see it's asking me uh, for my name after it introduces itself hey I'm Rick welcome to my blog and I'm not gonna read all of this because my voice is kinda 
um, scratchy right now and bothering me. Um, but it's it, it's prompting for the name, and I'm just gonna put in. Uh, we're just gonna put it. We're gonna use Mike right now. The person that's landed on this site is not me. It's Mike. And I use that picture because it, you know, that picture coordinates with my Facebook page as well. So, um, you know, if you guys are watching this on Facebook, you already know. But for those that are maybe watching this on YouTube or maybe anywhere else online where this video might be uh, positioned wherever it's at, um, that is um, coordinating with my Facebook page. So that's why I use that picture. Uh, but anyways, as you can see, the bot went through and says, thanks, Mike, you rock. Good to meet you. Quick question. Do you have a website or a blog? So it gets right to the conversation at hand. It doesn't go through a whole lot of small talk. You know, it just gets right to it. Like, hey, I'm here. You're here. Um, what's your name? So obviously I made the bot in whichever square it was, um, box it was. I asked, I put the, you know, your first name in parentheses so that the bot knows to, um, once you put in your name, after it prompts you to, then it knows to call you whatever you put in there throughout the conversation. So I dripped that throughout that um, bot conversation. Um, so do I have a bot? Yes, I have, or do I have a blog? Yes, I do. So you click that. Every precious minute of their two and a half hours on the surface was programmed. Rock and soil samples were to be collected. You know, I'm not doing this, guys, this is a bot. Experiments set up to catch unfiltered particles from the sun to record uh, moon quakes. You know, I put that little picture in there of, uh, I don't know, it's it's, um, it's an older movie that's Keanu Reeves, and I don't know who the other guy is, but it's Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. I always liked that movie when I was a kid. You know, it totally tells you how old I am. That's, that's movies 30 years old, probably. Um, so the bot goes through after it goes through all this and just talks about, you know, how you can basically uh, two times your leads on your website or your blog basically by using a bot uh, so it's kind of selling itself right here but that's how I have it set up as well uh, for now and this is just again just a test so you guys can check this out uh, I'm interested tell me more that's really the only prompt that I've given people they're either interested or not if they're not interested they can hit the X if they are they click that blue button and it continues the conversation. So I'm going to click that button, tell me more how this works. The bot's just going to continue to go ahead and keep on talking and, you know, put the pictures in there and, um, you know, it's going to continue to show the person what, you know, what the bot is about and how it all works. Uh, you know, who's using the bot? Well, Facebook use, uses bots, you know, Messenger, um, ManyChat, Starbucks, Spotify. Um, I'm going to look over here because it's hard for me to see that. Uh, MasterCard, Walt Disney, and then that's why there's, you know, I put this picture of Walt Disney in here. Um, what does this technology relate to? Actually, that's probably the one most people are going to click. A small business owner. Uh, I'm a small business owner. Um, how can this bot help me, or can I for afford it, or something like that? You know, because I'm not Disney. You know, I'm just a small business. How can I afford something like this? <laughs> That's the one I should have clicked. But I think it almost kind of comes back and and does the same thing. Um, it, it, but it, it it comes at it a different way depending on which button you press but ultimately at the very end before it asks the next question it, it funnels back to the same thing so and as you can see we've got different things that are in here that uh, have a relation to what we're talking about here with the bots and then it's prompting once again what kind of website will this work with and, or or how will this help me build an email list most likely you know that's what I the two questions that I think people are going to ask and that would be the one that I would pick would be this one so now the bots going to continue off of that 
choice that I made. Man, I'm gonna run out of water. I have to wrap this video up. It's getting to be pretty long here. So right here, I put in, um, you know, the, the user's name. One last question, Mike. Are you also interested in selling bots for profit? So like I said at the beginning of this video, you could actually sell these bots for profit. You can make bots for people because this is a commercial license. And you can sell these bots. Um, you know, and I think it says even in here, if you were to sell them, um, you know, some, some different price points that you can sell them at. And, and maybe that hasn't happened yet. Maybe that happens when I answer whether I want to sell, use this to sell bots, or I just basically right here, Every no, I just want to use bots on my own site. So, you know, a lot of people may not want to take and build bots right now. They may just want to you know sell these bots or just use these bots for their own blog or website so I'm gonna click that one and then I think here it's gonna you know talk about that's cool but you know here's what you could do and here's what you could make if you wanted to you know sell these bots create these bots and then sell these bots to other people and then right here, it's basically prompting people, you know, hey, if you want to purchase this bot for your blog or your website, only through this chat, it's available only through this chat, Mike, because that's the name I put in. And if somebody does decide to purchase, boom, they get five bucks off. So here's where it prompts them to put their um, email in. And I'm just going to, that's what I put in before, so I'm just going to put that in. Okay, great at gmail.com. So maybe somebody has that email and they're actually getting something. So basically it's prompting them, okay, great, thanks for you know putting in your email address, more or less. This is what they're saying. You get a 30-day money back guarantee. Uh, and I'm gonna go ahead and send you that five dollar coupon code to your email address. Um, so what you can do, you can take advantage of that right now while we're on this chat. That's what the bot's saying. Uh, so you just click this link and then it's gonna go over and it's gonna go over to your affiliate link for the bot itself, okay? So now we're on the sales page and guess what? A bot pops up prompting you to, um, you know, to purchase this through the affiliates link, which in this case is mine. If you buy the bot, it'll be yours. Um, so they can go through a demo right here, a little bit of conversation demo. And right here, they can go ahead and talk talk to the uh, the sales paid bot if they want to. Uh, it's got a, you know, $2 off coupon till Thursday. Oh, so. Uh, you get an extra two dollars maybe uh, in addition to the five i'm not real sure um and then there's a countdown timer and then of course you know if you're going if it looks like you're going to leave uh the sales page will pop up a bot uh, window and this i think this is like i'm not positive but i think this is like the extreme upgrade um because it's a lot like a pop-up that comes up for to prompt people to put their email address in so but I think you have to have the extreme upgrade to get this to happen so it noticed that I was getting ready to move off of the page and close the tab so this this dialog box pops up and says hey don't go anywhere tell me more let's you know got Trump there saying hey wait a minute you know so uh, I'm going to X that out because I really wasn't going off the page yet. Um, you, know, you guys can take a look at this page, but uh, what, which is my affiliate site, which is the sales page. So um, I think that's all I've got for right now. I think that's more than enough. So if you guys are looking to uh, to to get a bot, a bot, I was going to say bot on your blog and I kind of went blot <laughs> oh boy
it's getting late so if you guys want to purchase this bot uh, the link is below go ahead and check that out go through the sales page if you got any questions um, you know just get a hold of me over on Facebook I'm, I'm usually on there most of the time you can message me there or go to the blog ripplafada.com again it's not done there's no content but you know you can reach me on the blog through one of the bots either Every the Facebook uh, bot and a half hours um, the or the, the Conversio bot here, either one. But either way, uh, if you guys uh, want to check that out, definitely, I think it's worth the money. Um, I don't know if I'd pay $47 a month, but I mean, it, it could very well be worth the money to, to even pay that. I don't know. We'll see how many leads it brings in. But uh, that's all I got for now, guys. Uh, again, I uh, hope you liked the video. If you did like the video, please hit that like button below. That little thumb down there. Let's turn that thing blue, okay? Because I love the likes. Uh, if you got any kind of comments, I don't care if they're good or bad. You know, if the video is too damn long, I mean, just tell me about it. I'm sorry if it is too long, but, um, you know, I've got to go through and try to be as thorough as I can. Hopefully I was thorough enough but not so thorough to where you just got bored. I didn't even have a drink of water. But if you guys got any questions, you know, address them through the bot, through Facebook, leave me a comment. I can also answer through the comments if you're watching this on YouTube. And uh, again, subscribe to the channel. Um, you know, I want you guys to, to see everything that I've got coming out if, you know, if you're interested. In, in the videos that I do because you know I, I'm gonna try to do more and more of these videos but uh, I'm gonna try to cut my time down on some of these uh, product reviews because they can get a little bit long well that being said guys I'm out of here we'll see you on the next video peace